So today I thought I would do a tutorial on kind of a neutral eye using the Naked 2 palette. My cat keeps jumping a few. Say hello. Oh. Um, so to get started, I've already primed my eyes with Urban Decay uh, Primer Potion and Sin. And I'm going to just use the brush inside here. So this little brush and the flat edge. I'm going to take and pick up a little bit of water on the brush. And then I'm taking, I'm going to use Suspect, Snake Bite, and Busted. Let's see those. So I'm going to take Suspect first. <laughs> Why do you keep jumping up here, kitty? No. Me. I'm putting this in the inner half of my eye. And I'm taking, I'm also going to use Booty Call, which is that really light highlighter shimmer shade. I'm taking this and putting it underneath my eye also, the same brush. It's got a very narrow part, so I can use it for that. I can take snake bite. It's a pretty easy, everyday, simple, faster look. <laughs> now the cat's behind me playing with the leaves. I think that's what he was going after. I have like a little fake plant right here. Okay, I'm going to take busted on the same brush and just kind of work it on the outer corner and into my crease. Oh, and I forgot to put some snake bite underneath. I'm just going to do that real quick. Now I'm going to take that blending part and take Booty Call. I'm going to use that to smooth it up here under my, Ow! <laughs> under my brow bone. That kitty. Keep trying to kill Mama. Okay, now after I've highlighted my brow, I can go in and blend that darkest color in with the rest of the eyeshadow along with outer part. I didn't do my normal like more winged out look because it's supposed to be more natural for day but there's definitely some darkening in that area. And you're all done with eyeshadows. So now I can go in and curl my lashes and do one more coat of mascara. I already have one coat on so I'm going to curl them. Hopefully I'm not going down too low. Um, now I'm going to use Makeup Forever's Smoky Lash in Extra Black Matte Mascara. And I'm going to put it all over my eye. Darn it. There we go. Kind of cleaning up that spot. Alright, now I can let that dry and I'm going to put on Great Lash, Lots of Lashes by Maybelline, using the little cone brush to do my bottom lashes. If you want to tone this down even more for day, um, you don't have to use mascara on your lower lashes or false lashes like I will be. Now on to cheeks. I decided to go with kind of, um, I wanted to keep it pretty neutral, but I wanted to go with more of a peachy, corally look. So this is Alpha Girl Beauty Powder from MAC. 
take my blush brush, just swirl it on and apply the cheeks. Beauty powders have a really soft coloring to them. They never really are very pigmented. But they're very finely milled too, so it's nice to build them up a little bit and really smooth. Now I'm going to take Dior Amber Diamond and I'm going to use that to highlight my cheeks. As well as down my nose. And above my brows. And now I can go in and curl my lashes again. I'm going to take my Sonia Cusick Angled Eyeliner Brush and Wholesome MAC Fluid Line. Just any blackened brown will do. And I'm going to use this to line my waterline. I started lining my top lash. Okay. And I'm going to pause there so that I can take my false lashes, which are Demi Wispies from, you can get them at Walmart, anything um, by Lash Perfect. Or, yeah. And I'm going to apply lash glue on top. And I'm just gonna. Ooh, I already pinched the corners, so I got some of that lash glue off of it. There we go. So after I'm putting a thin line, I'm gonna let it dry a little so that it gets more tacky. And go back and finish lining my eyes. I'm gonna take this again and finish lining the top part of my eye. I'm doing just kind of a thinner, natural line. It's just something that's gonna hide the base of my false lashes. If I wasn't going to wear false lashes, which I usually do if I'm going to do my makeup, I'm going to just wear false lashes because I'm going to take the time to do everything else. It's kind of like doing all your makeup and then not putting on mascara. Like That's how false lashes are for me. Um, if I wasn't going to put on, I would just line my waterline to make it more natural. And plus then your, your lashes will stand out more because you don't have a dark line above them. Now I'm going to put the lashes on. This eye is probably going to look better than the other one. Well, the lashes will. Because this is a new set of lashes. Or a new pair. Uh, well, it's not up here. This is a new lash. Because um, I lost the other one in the set. So this one's an older one that actually has some wear. You can kind of see how they wear. And it's not bad, but it's definitely been worn compared to this one. Okay. Gotta make sure it stays on. Now I can go on to lips. And that's the eyes done. So I didn't line my lower lash line like I usually do. Um, because it's more of a daytime look. And some of that gel liner will transfer just ever so slightly down there anyways. Now I'm going to take Cutester. This is from MAC. This is in the Hello Kitty collection. And I like 
damaged it the first time I opened it. The pinky, peachy luster, I'd want to say. It's a luster, but it's like a peachy pink color, if you can see that. And then I'm taking Mimi, which is a little more peachy than pink, over top. This was also in Hello Kitty collection, but it did come out in a holiday set, too. So there we go. I'm all finished. Just uh, do that so it doesn't end up on my teeth. And I hope you guys enjoyed. I usually don't do um, daytime looks because if I get ready, it's for a nighttime look. I, I've been really lazy, especially lately. I haven't been doing my makeup every day unless I work. <laughs> So I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will talk to you all later. Bye.